Hi guys, I wanted to do a quick video um, of uh, one of my Inktober sketches for you guys um, and talk about that a little bit. I decided to participate in Inktober this year to help build better daily drawing habits. Um, Inktober, for those of you who don't know, is a drawing challenge started by an artist named Jake Parker. Uh, where you create one ink drawing each day in October. I've added a, a little link to his website in the description box below for anyone who's interested in learning more about him or the challenge. Um, I've just been amazed at how other artists have cranked out drawings every day for the month in past years. Um, artists that I've followed and I figured I'd give it a shot in my own way. Um, my goal wasn't to complete a finished drawing every day, but to at least draw something every day to find time to commit to doing what I love each and every day, which has been tough for me lately. Um, I didn't want to follow the Inktober prompts that a lot of artists are working with. That's like a word each day that they'll roll with and, and produce something based on that, that word or theme. Um, I just wanted to go with the flow and what I was inspired to draw each each day. Um, some pieces turned out to be completed drawings, even though I didn't intend that from the start, which is kind of cool. Um, there's lots of things that I've, I, lots of benefits from Inktober for me. I um, I've made tons of time to draw compared to the last year. Um, just holding myself accountable and committing to a challenge like this has made me realize I can make time for drawing every day. Um, it just has to be more of a priority. Uh, it's easy to say like other, other things need to be done and art doesn't, but we should all definitely make time for what we're passionate about. I've also, um, learned to loosen up a bit and was able to explore using ink in different ways without being too worried about screwing up. Uh, since, since these drawings or sketches weren't like too planned out like some of my other pieces, it was easier just to let go and go with the process, not worry about that all that much. And I forced myself to work with what I had which really pushed me to manipulate certain pens and markers in ways I probably wouldn't have if I had access to, to more supplies. Um, I've gotten used to posting art more without worrying about how it's going to be judged, which is cool. Um, social media can be intimidating at times, so that's always nice to just get it out there and deal. <laughs> I only have a few days left to wrap this up, so it's um, it's been a lot of fun, even though it's been difficult to find the time some days, but I think I might do more of these challenges and keep going, maybe focus on different types of, uh, of mediums for certain periods of time. I don't know. I think I've made some better habits, though, this month, which is cool. I'm just hoping to keep that up, so anyhow. Um, have a good one and I'll try to be making more videos soon.